Welcome to another episode of Big Lee's Corner. And I'm um, kind of in the middle of a mission, so I'm waiting on a phone call, so hopefully that won't interrupt my video. But anyway, I thought I'd kill some time with this video. Pro Wrestling Loot. Let's see, what month again? October 2019, maybe September, I don't know. My months, really, but it's sometime in 2019. And it's the middle of October, so I'm just going to say October. Which I might add, the greatest month of the year. All right, unboxing the box. Well, Wednesday Night Wars, which is referring to NXT versus AW Dynamite on TNT. And by the way, just for the fact NXT has some goof that I lost all respect for, which I never had any respect for them to begin with. But anyway, uh, talk about. Lashley's a little turd. Apparently they hired that goof back, so I'm definitely choosing AEW over NXT. And just think, I thought AEW was going to hire that goof, uh, that piece of crap. Or as Jim Cornette called him, 100 pound sponge when wet. I'm not going to go into details why I lost all respect, or hate that and goof even more, but... <laughs> Alright. Oh yeah, the Blocko Man, Randy Savage. But speaking of AEW, I may not tune into their Dynamite because it's on cable, but I do tune into. All right, this thing just gave me a. But anyway, yeah, I do tune into Dark, AEW Dark. And let's see, I also tune into NWA Power, which I'll admit, I myself declare that the best thing. It's ironic, there's a tag team called the Wild Cards. And after their victory over two jobbers, it was funny, Eddie Kingston confronts them afterwards. So, I mean, marks, only marks like me would get this one. That Eddie Kingston, back in 2002 through 2005, he was one half of a team called Wild Cards, and here he is confronting these current Wild Cards. So, yeah. And by the way, coincidentally, Kingston and Marciano's Wild Cards uh, pretty much featured playing cards. King of Diamonds and Black Jack and Jack of Spades. But anyway, we got... This playing card poster of Pentagon, I forgot if he's Pentagon Zero, Pentagon, but anyway, Phoenix and Pentagon, the Lucha Brothers, on a king of, uh, well, just a king, uh, playing card, king card, so hell yeah, that's awesome as fuck. I was saying, yeah, in a rush, but you know. I'm using that goof's last name I'm talking about, but I censor it by calling him Flesh. Hell yeah. Anyway, hero card. Now, apparently, the villain has become the hero. If this is who I think it is, Marty Skull. Well, I'm just going to go with that conclusion. If anyone knows if that's not Marty Skull, correct me. Styling and profiling since uh, 1972. And before I get to the 8x10, as usual, the Certificate of Authenticity by Jeff Dino. Ah, hell, we're taking it out of the bag. Anyway, former WWE and ECW luchador, super crazy. I think he was also super logo in the light heavyweight tournament. Someone correct me if I, but I would have to do my research. By that time, I'd probably forget all about this video, and um, I will never let you know, so you might have to remind me about this video that I thought Super Crazy was Super Loco, and if you want to correct me later on down that road, cool. 
Not as if I don't get boycotted for insulting um, Leo Flush. Anyway, that's all for this episode of Big Lee's Corner. I'll try to have a nice day. If you like this video, please like and subscribe for more.